Hello, family. Welcome back to CWA. 3.52 p.m., 12 22 Y'all, I'm fucking exhausted. <laughs> and this is the first video. I'm absolutely fucking exhausted. A friend of mine is in a very fucked up position. He needs $3,000 to get him pretty much, I would say, neutralized in a fucking situation. We're $200 short of that. Now, we done swung it as much as we could, so if y'all would like to donate, participate, however you want to put it, if you would like to donate to the cause, click either one of my links below. In the memo section, I need you to write from a helping hand or cousin love. It got to be something to where I'm I'm able to tell the difference. If you put for personal in the, in the memo section, that money's going in my pocket. If you don't write anything, that donation is going toward the channel. If you write cousin love, um, much love, from a helping hand, if you write any of that in the, in the memo section, it's going toward that cause. But it has to be something in the memo. Um, if you can't donate, you don't want to donate, that's fine. Don't give what you don't have. Don't stress about it. Because, nigga, any time's a good time for a drink, right? fucking exhausted man i might also do a 15 dollars flash sale that flash sale money will also go toward that cause because i can't think of any other ways to help with this last 200 we we are all tapped out at this point three thousand is a lot of money for the most part and i would say 200 dollars short ain't bad but I put the instructions in the description box because I don't really want to keep saying this through all the videos. But if I do a flash, so that money's going to go toward um, the cause and you'll have to write a uh, flash sale. But those will only be $15 in mini reads. So I'm still trying to figure out if if I'm about to even do that. This video is fun. I'm already about to need coffee that I can't drink because caffeine makes my heart break. Right back in the fucking hospital again. And I switched work. Four pentacles, five of cups. Temperance. Amen. The sun and the seven of wands with the strength. All right, this is when you're in a position and you're just trying to figure you just trying to figure it the fuck out. You're just trying to figure it the fuck out. Period. And it's almost it's like everything that you fucking try is just that shit's all dead. Like, like, what, like, when do I get a break, bruh? When do I get a break, bruh? Divine intervention is in here. Yesterday. I went to the store, came back. Now it's snow outside. I had my phone in my hand as I was walking up to the door. I put my phone actually in my um. I'm lying. I had it in my hand. I put it in my hoodie pocket. 
But I knew that my phone was not all the way in there, but the case, for whatever reason, this part of the case just would not make it go in there. But I had my hands full of stuff, right? Nigga, tell me how. Now, mind you, at this point, I'm trying to do any and everything I can to help this nigga get to the last 200, so I'm stressed out. Stressed. Nigga, my stepmama not even bought me. She done had the shit shipped from Amazon, uh, stress and anxiety pills. I would get up and get it. Shit's over there, right? This is how divine intervention works. I'm like, man, what the fuck? Like, it's only $200. Why that shit seems so hard? Like, what the fuck, right? I'm walking up the steps, and my phone falls into the fucking snow. It falls just like this. Like, all I can see is this part of my fucking phone. Like, that's it. Mind you, I'm looking for my I get in the house. I'm like, hold up. Where's my phone? Like, I done tore the whole room apart. I done tore the living room apart. I done tore everywhere apart. And I'm like, damn, but if it would have failed, especially in the house, I have hardwood floors. If it would have fell in the house, I would have heard it. Right? Unless it fell on the carpet, but even still, I would have heard like some type of drop. Now, when I came in, I was like overly heated. Like, I'm still, my body is still catching up to the medicine. So I'm not all the way right just yet. I'm like, man, what the fuck? Like, we're now nah, freaking out. It's my fucking phone, man. Like, what the fuck? I don't got no time to waste. Where's my phone? My alarms, I have three alarms set for every day. Those are reminders to take a, all of my fucking medicines. All of them, right? I got to take medicines three times a day, right one time. Now, I lost my phone around, let's say, about 5, 30, 6 o'clock. My phone's in the fucking snow. Now, I knew that my phone was in the snow because I hadn't heard my phone nowhere. I'm like, damn, I know it's outside. I know it's outside. But it could only be from this short distance. And I'm looking all around. Can I find my phone? Nigga. And it's dark outside. My phone is black. So I'm like, damn, like, what the fuck? I done went outside four times and went even further over this is to walk back. Maybe, maybe I dropped it. Maybe I don't know. Now, one of my alarms is set for 2.30. The other one is set for 10.30, eight hours apart. Right? I'm like, damn, I, I have to wait until 10.30 because my alarm's going to go off. If it's in the house, It'll ring at 1030 on the dot. I'll be able to hear it around the house. So I, I made a big ass thing of spaghetti. I made taco spaghetti, right? So I'm eating. I'm like, fuck it. At that point, I'm just like, fuck it. If my phone fucked up. I just go, I just have to wait to go get another one tomorrow. Right? I got insurance on my phone. Shit, they give me a new one. I ain't tripping. Maybe I need a new phone. Maybe, maybe, you know what I'm saying? Because at this point, it's like, okay, it's divine intervention. It's a reason that I'm not supposed to like have this phone right now. 10 30 on the dot com, I don't hear it ringing in the house. So I'm like, fuck it. Maybe it gotta be outside. Maybe I accidentally threw it away because I took the trash out yesterday. Yeah, I threw it away. I walk outside at 10 31. My alarm is still ringing. I hear my phone, which means it's outside in the snow, but I don't know where. So I, I'm walking to the trash can. I'm like, damn, I'm getting further from it. Walk back. I hear it, but it seems far away still. So I walk back toward the trash. I'm like, okay, it's not over in this area. I walk back. My phone is sitting just like this, directly upright in the snow, and it's just fucking ringing. My phone was perfectly fine. Alarm went off right on time. My shit was good, right? So my brother, like, man, what the fuck? My phone was just fucking fell in the snow for hours. It was in the snow. He like, man, you got to be more careful. I'm like, yeah, that's one way of looking at it. Everything right there in that moment that I figured out, like, this is my intervention, everything told me I needed a break from that shit. When you got so much pressure and it's just pressure after pressure, you got to take a break. When you refuse to sit back and take a break, divine is going to make you take a break. I say that to say it's something that you clearly are stressing about. You're going to get on timeout. 
You're going to have to sit on time out. Because there's something that you need to see from a different point of view. And during that time out, you're going to see shit completely different. The hangman, the sun, the seven of wands, and the strength, you get an idea or you get you get clarity. That all comes after you take a step back. Shit's being balanced out. Believe it or not, I don't know what it is you're going through, but believe it or not, it's divine intervention, bro. Believe it or not, the Tower and the Eight of Pentacles is divine intervention. What's this? And I feel like, too, I feel like you're waiting for bad news that you're not going to get. King of Swords. The way that you're going about something is not right. Yeah, the Page of Wands, the High Priestess, and the Seven of Swords, the way you're going about something isn't right. The Empress. So you're going to get pulled and you're going to get like, I don't, you're going to get pulled and you're going to get um refilled. So I feel like the way that you're going about something is poisonous. It's not helping you at all. So you're going to get the Ace of Wands, the Will of Fortune, King of Pentacles. You're going to get, I feel like, a, a new plan, a new route, a new pathway. This is Five of Swords in the Death. Yeah, Hangman and the Three of Pentacles. And honestly, I don't know what to tell you, bro. The Devil and the Ten of Cups, I don't know what to tell you. I really don't. Because the energy here is it is what the fuck it is. Let it all work out. Like, you feel like divine leaving you hanging and shit. Just let it work itself out. Easier said than done. But there is a reason that this shit is happening. Whatever, whatever's happening, there's a reason that this shit is happening this way. What's this? Yeah, page of swords and the nine of swords. Cause you're completely stressed the fuck out. And you keep doing something over and over and over and you're disappointed. You're disappointed about how this shit's turning out. Nine of Swords and a Magician. You're disappointed about... So, Divine... Because you don't see something. Divine is setting something up directly how it's supposed to be. And you're mad because it seems... I feel like you're uncomfortable. But this is where the real shit kick in. With this strength here, you never know how strong you are until you have to be. Push it to the limit. Like This is weird though because I feel like last minute something works out. This is like the very, at the, right when you're at the end of that countdown, something works out. You're spending all your time trying to, like, I don't even know. Just like trying to pay your rent doing surveys. It's not going to work. You keep trying to pay your rent or your car note or you keep whatever the fuck to, to with service. It's just not going to work. You putting all your eggs in one basket. What's this? 
Yeah, Judgment and Knight of Cups. It's time to stop being so naive. Seven of Pentacles. But the thing is, it, it really just feels like whatever the fuck you, whatever you're stressed about or whatever, whatever the fuck's going on, the solution's coming. But the thing is, It's like a kill switch, bro. It's like a kill switch, bro. So, it's like the situation was set up how it is, right? You get to do all of these different things to try to figure out how the fuck to make something work. Because you won't stop, like, because you, you grab hold of something and that's just what it is. You you trying to milk this shit like whatever it is you trying to you, you're trying to milk whatever the situation is you're trying to milk it. Hit, hit the kill switch. Divine hit the kill switch on this. You went dark. Divine hit the kill switch because you grab hold of something and you 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 get tunnel vision on it. That kill switch is the only way to turn it off. So if you get put in time out, and that's how you let the beat build. Whatever you're obsessively doing, because I saw the devil and I see the devil again, whatever it is that you're obsessively doing, Yeah, it's time for a new plan. It's time for a new route. Because you're determined to, you you beating a dead horse trying to get it to breathe again. That shit's not going to work. You you beating a dead horse trying to make it a prize winning, uh, a prize winning horse. And no, it's, it's dead. You just don't want to hear that. Though. But it is, it's shit's dead. It's over with. But it's not. See, it's over, but it's it's a good way. It's a good thing. I just really get the energy that you're stubborn. You grab hold of something. You just like, I'm going to do this. This is like um, when you write down, you write down a plan. And then one thing happens that fucks up everything. Like the main source of something fucks up everything. That goes away, everything's fucked up. But you trying to plead with... You don't see the gazelle pleading with the fucking lion, bro. What's this? You don't see the gazelle pleading with the lion. You literally see a lion in this card. With strength. So you're not the gazelle, but you keep acting like you are. There's a solution. Whatever you're currently doing is not the fucking solution. Fear does not exist here. What's this? I don't stress out, nigga. Ace of Pentacles. Nipsey. I don't stress. I don't stress out, nigga. I put my chest out, nigga. Like, I don't, I don't stress. That should be one of your theme songs here. I don't stress. I don't stress out, nigga. That pressure bring the best out, nigga. Like, you scared to, you scared of the pressure. Because honestly, I see nothing but pressure here. And pressure makes diamonds. Extreme heat, is it, it makes diamonds. The pressure makes the diamond, but the extreme heat is, is, is to tell if that diamond makes the cut or not. You're going to have to recycle your pain, my nigga. You, you hurting right now. 
Four of Pentacles and the Five of Cups. King of Swords, you hurt me. But this ain't the time to fold. What's this? This ain't even gonna be that. This ain't the time to fold. You done been through shit worse. Or you done been through you done been through some shit that, that led you to this point. But you just gotta wait to see what divine do. You feel like you left hanging in the fucking balance right now, like you looking for extreme guidance. And it's it's you just shit just gonna it's almost like you just gonna wake up one day, shit just gonna be like everything gonna be good. I know that sounds weird, but remember when I said Divine is driving the car? You in the car seat, you don't get no say. Oh, well, McDonald's, you ain't eating that poison. What are you talking about? Okay, but I just, no, we got food at home. That's what you mad about. This is the equivalent of. A kid being like, uh, I want you being a kid. I want blah, blah, blah. I want to go to the restaurant. I want to go eat something outside of the house. And, and your people is like, nah, we got food at home. Fuck you talking about? We got food at home. A lot of food. But, but I just want, nah, we got food at home, bucko. And you mad about that. You got healthy options versus something that's killing you. You can see the shit made in house versus you don't even know if these niggas don't wash their dishes correctly. And you happily just eat it. Nah, we got food at home. That's where you mad at. You mad because something's not going your way and it ain't supposed to. You still get what you want. It's just not, you just don't see something. But the three of pentacles and the ace of pentacles with the sun, the seven of wands, and the strength, your hard work is not going unnoticed. It's not, it's not in vain. It's not in vain. But you mad because you feel like it is. <laughs> you okay? You all right. Every little thing is going to be all right. Don't worry about a thing. I'm telling you. This five of pentacles, eight of wands shit, you feeling left out, you feeling alone by yourself, you feeling broke, you feeling broken, that shit's about to go away real fast. The high priest is ten of cups, seven of cups. You just don't see it because you won't take the time to even think about the possibility of the vine that stepped in here. When shit does not work out the way you planned on it, it's probably because it's saving your ass. It ain't no fucking, it, it's not rejection, my nigga. It's, it's, it's a redirection. See, you get attached to shit you ain't supposed to. And if you have that problem, you had that problem your whole life, you gonna, we gonna do this until you get it right. Until you learn to, to, to detach from things that are no longer suiting you, you're gonna be fucked up. And that's on the fam. You gonna be, you're going to be fucked up until you learn to detach from things that you do not actually need anymore. You don't want to see it like that, though. You just want to look, what, what, God, just, no, bro. My ears ringing. The sun, the three of pentacles, and the fucking ace of pentacles. You're getting what you need. You ain't getting what the fuck you want. You get what you need, period. You need the essentials. What you want don't matter right now. It's a tough pill to swallow, but it is what it is. You don't get what the fuck you want. And you don't just up and do something because you think you're going to force some shit to work out like that. That's not happening either. Until you learn the lesson here, which is detach, you're going to be fucked up. Person, place, or thing. You got to trust what you don't know. And I'm not talking about people. I'm talking about divine. The reason you want time out is because you don't fucking listen. Your heart.
Four of Pentacles, Five of Cups, you're holding on to something you should not be. I don't know what or who it is, but I see it. There's a brand new beginning right there that's going to balance everything out. You just don't, you don't want it. You don't want it. You still, you still want less than. You still want less than and you mad. Because a motherfucker won't let you get, the motherfucker won't let you have something that's not for you. You acting like a, you acting like a, a fucking gazelle. Every day you're running from something. Nine of cups and that's why you're not happy. <laughs> you can have everything in the world, but you, 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 you're pissed poor morally. So you ain't happy with nothing that you got. Ain't no such thing as a life that's better than yours. And it ain't another one like you in this bitch. So why are you acting as though everything happens to you? How you don't see it's happening for you? You getting the fuck up out of there. But you 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 want to hang on to something that's going to have you fucked up later on? All right, well, that's your problem. And you're going to keep dealing with that until you get that shit fixed. That's why you've been on timeout, too. You refuse to let go of this five of pentacles shit that do not serve you. And you got the nerve and all that. Shit. Why me? Why me? Why not you? The fuck? Because it ain't another one like you in this bitch. That's why it's you. You the only one that don't see that shit. The world, the six of wands, the five of wands, and the eight of wands. And the five of pentacles. You're going to be fucked up until you figure it the fuck out. It ain't nobody on planet Earth that can give you this answer at this point. You, you, yeah. Nobody on Earth can give you this fucking answer. But this ten of swords and this star, the minute you get your head out your ass, you're going to see it for what it is. Pull your head out your ass and act like you got some fucking sense. Because you're getting what you need. Not what the fuck you want. It ain't time for you to have what you want. It's a necessity to get what you need because you're learning lessons in this stage. You think you're going to skip them? That's not happening. It's not happening. You think you're going to skip what you... What, what, no, that's not happening. You get what the fuck you need. Do you understand me? What you want don't matter. And what you think you need don't matter. What you need is going to be provided for you. You need oxygen to breathe. You don't need a brand new BMW to go stun around the city. You get what I'm saying? I feel like what you want is fucking unrealistic to actually what's going on. See, the reason that you don't see the divine plan is because you're being unrealistic. Again, this is the equivalent of I'm about to pay my rent doing surveys. No. That get rich quick shit, if it's easy, it ain't for you. If it's easy, it ain't gonna work and it ain't gonna last. Something that you, whatever's being dismissed from you right now, it was easy for you to obtain. It, it, it was easier than previous situations for you to obtain. Easy is being taken away. Now, you don't know what to do. Why? Because instead of you doing, man, you, you're trying to take the easy way out, it's not going to happen. I'll be back.